Hello everyone, welcome to this another video of this ELOP 7 series. In this video, I will be show you the installation of the ELOP 7. So for starting the installation, first of all, uh, I will open my Google Drive because the installation I am going to show you, uh, it's in Colab, okay? Because uh, you might not have GPU, okay, in your system so that uh, I can uh, show you like uh, if you don't have uh, GPU, okay, in your system, so you can use Google Colab also uh, to set up your environment and the same thing you can apply on your local, okay? So in this uh, uh, course, okay, I'll be showing you the entire thing on uh, Google Colab, okay? So you can try it on local. So uh, uh, before uh, so uh, first of all what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take a like Google collab notebook here so this is the Google collab notebook I will take and uh, this is the official version uh, of this yellow v7 repository okay so first of all what we what we need to do uh, we just need to clone this repository okay in our uh, like collab uh, then I will be uh, doing the installation of this requirement.txt okay so uh, let's do that so I will uh, name this YOLO v7, YOLO v7, okay. And uh, make sure you are connecting with your GPU, okay. So because here I think I have GPU. So runtime, none, GPU, and save, okay. So let's see which GPU I got. So I will write NVIDIA, NVIDIA. This is the command like to check the GPU, okay. M NVIDIA SMI. So if you just write and execute the code. So guys, uh, here you can see I got Tesla T4 because here I am using this free collab, okay. Uh, if you have uh, like collab pro, so you can also use that. So uh, first of all, what I need to do, uh, I will just uh, come here and click on this code and copy this uh, HTTPS link, okay. And what I will do, I will just write git clone, git clone and I will paste the link here. And if I now run it, okay, so it will cl clone this repository inside my uh, this uh, Google Colab, okay. If you see here, now I I I, I want to uh, install this requirement.txt because inside requirement.txt will get uh, all the requirement packages, okay. Uh, we we need to install here. And one thing actually I forgot to tell you. Uh, so here uh, this was like our our unofficial version of Yellow V7, okay. So if you want to use this unofficial version of Yellow V7, okay. So there actually you need to install Detect on 2 because it is based on Detect on 2, okay. So if you see uh, here, it is based on Detect on 2. But uh, uh, in our official uh, this Yellow V7, okay, we don't need Detect on 2 uh, to install, okay. So it only needs like these are the packages. So if you see here, uh, so these are the packages actually we need okay so it is also uh, like uh, referring tensorflow and all okay so uh, and uh, the main thing is like torch okay torch library will get here so make sure whenever you are using uh, like this unofficial version of yellow v7 you need to install uh, detect on 2 okay in your uh, environment otherwise it won't work so and uh, another thing like uh, whenever you are uh, using this yellow v7 of un un unofficial version so your uh, data input should be coco format okay so it always takes coco format uh, like data annotation data because if you remember like uh, in detect on 2 used to pass uh, coco format data set okay and in our official uh, version of this yellow v7 okay it takes like yellow format data set okay so this th uh, two things like uh, they have done some uh, so th so this is the like major difference between this unofficial and official version of yellow v7 okay you will find so now well, let's uh, see like our installation of this requirement.txt so before that what, what I'm gonna do first of all I have to enter uh, in this yellow v7 okay this folder so I will just write cd and I will write yellow v7 okay now if I enter so now I'm inside yellow v7 okay now uh, I, I, I need to install this requirement.txt so what I will do I'll just uh, write uh, pip install pip install uh, ipen r okay now requirement.txt requirements dot txt okay now if i uh, run it so see uh, it will uh, install each and everything in my uh, this uh, collab environment okay so now let's wait uh, until it uh, gets over so guys you can see our installation is done okay uh, so in our next video i'll be showing you like how to prepare your custom data sets okay and how to do the annotation and all so yeah guys uh, this was all about from this video and uh, i think you have liked it so thank you so much guys for watching this video and i will see you next time